2001, I won my first championship gold in a single. 2001, on the start line, I was sitting in my boat and my exact word was like, shit, I'm not even warm. I didn't manage to get the boat running on the, on the warm up. I'm totally screwed, this is, I'm done, totally finished. On 7.50, I looked around and the guys was around me. And I thought like, what are you guys doing? I've been rowing really, really bad and I had this bad start. So, sorry for you, because now I'm gonna, now I'm gonna start row properly. I don't think I, I know actually how big it was until a couple of weeks, a couple of months later. For me, it was just a big relief. We went to the finals, to the start, for the final, and we had in mind to say, okay, this is the day we can make it. We can be world champion. It was in 1993 in Rudnice, and actually <laughs> we, we, we became world champion. So uh, I think, yeah, to be a world champion, you have to start the final with the willingness to win. And we got the second title in 1997 in Egbolet. It's, it's so great to, to be able to share with, uh, with the people around. And I must say that, yeah, my second title being in France was really special. I vividly remember my legs starting to seize up and that sensation of, you know, just keep moving, just keep flowing. And, uh, and the realisation was a couple of strokes before the line was all of a sudden you realise the grandstand was there. Um, the French crew with John Christophe Roland was coming behind us and uh, we managed to make it. You do a bit of a celebration and, uh, yeah, really special moment. Very exciting moment that first time in, uh, in Gifu to, to win a, a gold medal and I guess what added to that was uh, you know it was an incredibly special moment for New Zealand rowing. Uh, we won four gold medals in 45 minutes, uh, four events after each other. It was uh, you know pretty spectacular and, and to be a part of that was uh, it was really special. The, the first uh, medal at the, the lightweight men's gold was really really fantastic. When I came into the World Championships. The year after, I feel this huge pressure, pressure as uh, the defending world champion. And then it was kind of actually a big relief <laughs> when I uh, won the number two. The third time was just fun and nice and good and also really nice to get there and have free. There's very really people out there that can go one year or two years and they're winning world championship medals you know that doesn't really happen it takes years and years on grind of hard work um, to to really learn how to do it it may sound sort of weird but you can't just doesn't just happen for you you got to learn how to win um, and that's what we found over the years as we got closer and closer and we started getting some medals and then we won some races in two set, uh, 2007 and then won world championships and then you know, it was just celebrating because we we've done it you know we've made that step from from being there or thereabouts to actually winning the World Championship title and you know it's one thing that we'll probably never ever forget. As far as coming in as world champions it doesn't really mean too much to us because um, yeah, we've got to go out and win it over again. We've, we've made that mistake in the past. There's no advantage being world champion from last year, no one, no one cares about that. You look up to those people and try and um, almost see how do they do things, maybe that's how we should be doing things if we want to also be world champions. So it's definitely people that you look up to and try and, you know, not copy but see how they're doing things right and maybe you can do things better. Uh, it's something that I've aspired to be for the last 10 years since I've started rowing and I'd imagine it would be an amazing feeling. It's something that I think about every single day when I'm out there rowing. It was pretty good feeling getting that confirmed that we, we were the best on um, that day and uh, that's that's my that's my philosophy that we were world champions on that date last year and the day after we weren't world champions anymore so after the first day after the final you start working to become a world champion once more